So here it is. This is the new bike, the 1600 Triumph Thunderbird. Twin discs, twin uh, Brembo, ECB, nice twin discs at the front. Uh, 120 tyre on the front, uh, 200 on the back. Lovely, comfy, classic cruiser. Low seat height as well. Seat height, pretty low down. Comes really low. Um, very comfortable, nice and wide. Two up option as well. Uh, the bike did come with a detachable sissy bar, which I've taken off. And loving it. It's also got these engine bars on, on the bike as well, which I've kept on at the moment. Better turn it off now in case I end up with flat battery. Yeah, belt drive, tors pipes, these are the tors, lovely, great sound off them. Just got a lovely silhouette to the bike, it's just a big, beefy, muscle cruiser. Uh, new belt installed by a previous owner, as well as new oils fitted, new back tyre. There's the 200. Uh, Avon Cobra, loads left on that. In terms of size, the bike is a lot bigger than what I've uh, ridden before. It comes in lengthwise, it's a longer bike. It says it's 2340 millimetres, which equates to 92.1 inches in length. The width is 880 mil, which is 34.6 inches in width, including the handlebars. Uh, the height is uh, 44.1 inches. So, still a manageable bike, 339 kilos. Uh, which is seven four seven pounds when it's wet, but slowly but surely getting used to it. Um, nice big twenty two litre tank, plenty of range in there. You've got two hundred odd miles. See, it's got a nice uh, Thunderbird classic kind of centre dial there, heated grips as well on this one, and the nice Triumph uh, branding on the brake fluid reservoir cover. That's pretty cool. Let's hear how she sounds, shall we? Somebody's also taken the original tank badges off and replaced them with these uh, kind of older classic. The older classic tank badge. I like that, it's a nice nice look, a bit more in keeping with the, the look of the bike. But yeah, the Bobber Black was a great bike, nice three years with the Bobber Black, but this is uh, taking it up a notch or two. So looking forward to getting out and doing some trips. As I say, it has got the sissy bar which will be fitted, so it should be uh, very handy for doing some trips up north and maybe further afield this year. Get some actual proper bike trips done. But yeah, this was just a quick video to give you a look at the new bike, 2009 Thunderbird, Triumph Thunderbird, Tors pipes, um, heated grips, a few other wee bits and pieces just to, to add in. Got it on a private deal down south from a seller uh, on Marketplace, really good deal, happy with it. Uh, just a case of getting used to the bike now and just slowly but surely. It's just a, such a look at the low seat, the low seat height there, you can really see how that low kind of uh, profile of it. Perfect for me, I'm five foot nine. Um, fits me perfectly, I can still flat foot the bike. There's a Triumph caliper for the rear brake there. And this 200 cracking big tyre on the back. Uh, as I say, it does come with a nice wee detachable sissy, I'll be putting that on. Slots nicely just onto these bolts. And this back seat can come off and just leave it with a single seat. That's all plans for going ahead in the summer, or the better weather in the spring. 
Yeah. Triumph branded teardrop mirrors that came on it as well. So yeah, thanks for. Sorry, but the, the lack of uh, videos in the channel has not been much happening over the past few while since the bobber went and some other bits and pieces. But yeah, we've we've now got a new bike for the channel, so there will be a bit more happening in terms of motor vlogs and moto vlogging bits and bobs like that. So thanks for sticking around, thanks for your patience, and uh, keep tuned in for more updates on the bearded bobber, bearded thunderbird, X Harley. X Triumph Bobber now Thunderbird channel, God knows where it's gonna lead, what we'll get involved in. But yeah, hopefully this year we'll be getting more miles out and about and up north and all over the place. Take this bike as far as we can get it. Enjoy it, get some miles done, get some scenery, get some sunshine hopefully. The sun's trying to poke through the clouds here in a kind of uh, early March day here in Glasgow, you know. So we'll see what we can get involved and have some nice scenic runs this year. So thanks for staying tuned and uh, all the best. Big belter of a motorbike, 1600cc.